Did you know that more than 50 hormones are actively working in your body daily? And these hormones control every bodily function that you have. Digestion, heartbeat, hair growth, sweat, tears, weight loss, everything. And did you know that those hormones all work synergistically with estrogen and progesterone, which are the two primary hormones affected during menopause? And as those hormones decrease, then they will naturally affect the other hormones and glands in your body. Of all those hormones and glands, there are three main areas of metabolic distress that I've seen most often in my practice, and I will be covering those three in this episode. And these are the symptoms that affect menopause in women age 40 to 65. I'm Tafika Kier and welcome to the Mr. Menopause Show. After 40, a series of metabolic and hormonal changes affect practically every aspect of your body and your health. And this is especially true for women between 40 and 65 who are experiencing menopause and other midlife health and wellness issues. The hormonal changes during menopause can actually exacerbate symptoms when there are other areas of metabolic distress in the body, which is why different women will have such varied symptoms during menopause. A menopausal woman experiencing metabolic adrenal distress will require a very different nutrition and wellness plan and solution than a menopausal woman with metabolic liver or thyroid distress. The problem is many metabolic distresses have similar symptoms that mimic what most people think of as symptoms of menopause. So if you only focus on solutions for menopause, this can most likely be why your symptoms are not getting better. And if you are struggling with non-menopause related hormone health and weight issues, you are most likely experiencing a metabolic distress as well, or even a combination of distresses. So the key is to determine which metabolic distress you may or may not be experiencing. And if you are experiencing metabolic distress, you need to focus on the specific nutrition, fitness, and lifestyle solutions for that particular distress in order to regain control of your body, and eliminate the symptoms that you've been struggling with for years. When women go through the change of life, they think of things like hot flashes, fatigue, poor energy, and belly fat as natural symptoms or natural byproducts of menopause. However, most symptoms are caused by different hormone and metabolic distresses resulting from a domino effect that happens when progesterone and estrogen start to dissipate during menopause. Estrogen and progesterone work synergistically with and supply support for other hormones, glands, and metabolic functions throughout the body. So when estrogen and progesterone decline, as they do during menopause, they no longer supply the same support to those other areas in the body. And let's just suppose that you're someone who already are experiencing a health condition when you enter menopause. And by the way, 49% of women over 40 report having three or more chronic health conditions. In that case, those conditions can and will most likely worsen during menopause. For example, hypothyroidism, adrenal fatigue, food allergies, food intolerances, liver problems, and many other illnesses can cause hot flashes. But most people assume it's just menopause. Now, I have a client named Maria who had chronic hot flashes every 30 minutes. She also had chronic fatigue, poor sleep, and stubborn weight gain, and she was also being treated for hyperthyroidism, and she just did not feel well. So she went to the doctor initially and was subsequently diagnosed with menopause. And just like many of you, she tried the same treatments, the herbs and the supplements to help with her symptoms. And just like many of you, she could not get any substantial long-term relief. So then she came to me 
and I started with a metabolic distress evaluation to determine where her symptoms were. Her results did not show as hyperthyroid related just based on the symptoms that she reported to me, and she also had a deficient number of symptoms that were related to a reproductive distress, which was odd because that would be the distress most commonly related to menopause. So I created a plan based on healing the symptoms that she had reported specifically to me, and in less than eight weeks, she eliminated all of her symptoms except for the hot flashes. But she said other than that, she felt amazing. But I know from my experience that she could get hot flash relief, so I recommended that she have her thyroid numbers checked again by her doctor. Because from my experience, thyroid medication can actually change thyroid function. And one of the symptoms associated with hypothyroidism is hot flashes. And sure enough, the new blood test showed that her thyroid medication had changed her hyperthyroid condition to a hypothyroid condition. Her doctor then changed her medication and her hot flashes went away within just a few weeks. She went from having hot flashes every 30 minutes to having no hot flashes at all. So based on her results, the hot flashes were related to a metabolic thyroid distress. Had she just gone on HRT immediately after getting her menopause diagnosis, then she would have most likely continued to suffer with those hot flashes until her next thyroid exam, which was not for another 8 to 10 months away. Now, from my experience, those symptoms were compounded by the drop in estrogen and progesterone that happened when she went through menopause, but it was not the actual cause of the symptoms. And I share this to say menopause does not have to be detrimental to your health or your quality of life. Menopause is a natural progression that happens in a woman's life and that every woman will experience on some level. It can happen without struggling with all the health, weight, and hormone issues that are typically known to be part of the process. So if you're going through any of the three stages of menopause and you want to eliminate the symptoms that you've been struggling with, you may want to rethink how you're addressing your symptoms because the root cause may have just been exacerbated by menopause, but not caused by menopause. Now, all those symptoms like tiredness, trouble falling asleep at night, difficulty waking up in the morning, salt and sugar cravings, stubborn belly fat, and needing stimulants like caffeine to get through the day are, again, commonly associated with menopause. They are just as prevalent with someone experiencing a metabolic adrenal distress. The adrenal glands and hormones are most commonly related to stress and are considered the stress hormone. And by the way, this is any type of stress, mental, physical, or emotional stress. Now the key to strengthening your adrenal response is to provide your body with the correct balance of targeted nutrition that is known to heal and improve an adrenal distress, along with proper workout plans that help to restore and strengthen the body while minimizing pain and fatigue. And by the way, adrenal distress is the most common distress for most people since stress is part of everyday life. So it's all about managing managing your stress and your health in order to prevent stress from negatively impacting your body and your life. The third area of distress that I treat most often with menopausal women in my practice is a metabolic liver distress. Now, I do want to say that there are many, many other distresses that women can experience during menopause. Things like digestive issues, blood sugar problems, cardiovascular issues, many, many different things that can happen. I'm sharing the three most prevalent with the moms and the women that I work with most often. Now, the liver is responsible for detoxifying everything that goes through your body. It's your natural filtration system. Things like hormones, chemicals, food, bacteria, parasites, medications, and toxins all filter through the liver. The liver also breaks down fats, carbohydrates, and proteins. Our fat-burning hormones all work through the liver, and the liver is also responsible for hundreds of bodily functions every single day. 
Now, certain supplements, meal programs, and even meal replacement ingredients can actually harm the liver. So it is imperative to know and understand your distress and what can heal it as well as what can damage it. During improper exercise during a liver distress can also hinder healing and promote more liver distress. And all these things cause the symptoms that most women are thinking are menopause related when it may just be liver related. Figuring out your metabolic distress is much more detailed than just having a few symptoms. And as I've shared, making wrong choices may lead to further distress, more symptoms, and more health problems. Now, the nutrition and physical activity solutions for metabolic distress will also differ based on the specific symptoms that you're experiencing. It's also why the workouts and the diets that used to get you excellent results are no longer working. It's not a calories in versus calories out issue. It's a metabolic health and hormone distress issue. Now, as part of my commitment to menopause awareness and women's health, I have created a free monthly membership called Menopausal Moms. In the membership, I share health and vitality workshops that are based on different menopause-related themes every month. You'll also get an accompanying guidebook to help guide you step-by-step -step through each healthy aging process in order to minimize menopause symptoms and boost health and vitality. You'll get weekly trainings, Ask Mr. Menopause Q&A sessions, community events, challenges, discounts, and more. Menopausal Moms is a free membership, and you can absolutely unsubscribe and remove yourself at any time. Now, suppose you want to upgrade to get more coaching directly with me. Then you'll want to join my Menopausal Super Moms membership. In that, you'll get everything from Menopausal Mom, but you also get monthly recipes. And my recipes have actually become many of my clients' family favorites. Their kids love them, they love them, and they're great. You also get access to my workout library with a new workout added every week and so much more. The upgraded Menopausal Supermoms membership is $49 a month, and same thing, you can cancel at any time. Now, the free Menopausal Moms membership is best for self-starters who just need to know what to do, and they're able to follow the guidelines and get it done. The upgraded Menopausal Super Moms membership allows anyone who needs more coaching, more accountability, and wants more interaction in order to stay accountable and committed. Scan the QR code on the screen to learn more and to get signed up today. I hope you got tremendous value from this episode and that you will share it with your family and friends. And please, if you have not subscribed yet, please make sure that you subscribe to the Tafik TV channel. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, please be safe and be well.